idea for this came about five days after the spill, and we were talking about the potential impact and you know what we could do to protect the sea basin. And one of the things that we came up with is using the modules, but hanging a absorbent material. The Versadox system, as it its name implies, it's versatile, essentially floating Lego cubes that allow you to configure a dock for a multitude of, of uh, functions. The one that we're looking at today is configured for uh, oil protection. The key to this system's success is the fact that we're using a hydrophilic material that absorbs oil yet allows water to pass through. Traditionally, what they're doing is they're using a floating boom material, which is a closed plastic curtain with a float and weights. Uh, and that gives you a barrier. Then, in front of that barrier to absorb oil, they're throwing uh, what are called pigs, which are cylindrical pieces of this absorbent material uh, in net. But if you have it just in the first inch of water, you're not getting anything more than an inch below the surface. Again, our prime advantage is we have, we're able to capture uh, more of the waste product in a larger column of water. The prime advantage of this system is the fact that we get airborne, airborne spew from waves. Uh, as, as wind pushes water, water breaks up, so we can now catch oil particulates in the top of the barrier. Plus, we go down two feet into the water column. We can go down even further in the water column depending upon how we set the height of the handrail. We've been using um, and working with Versadoc for a number of years, and it's an ideal platform for us launching our boats, and it's very sensitive and safe to all the boats. And when this uh, oil situation happened, um, we were very concerned like everyone else. And then um, Roy Ahern, who Versadoc, came up with an idea of utilizing Versadoc as a way to help contain the oil. Uh, in the event it comes here, but more importantly, getting it over there in uh, the Gulf. I think it represents one of the better solutions of cleaning up the Gulf. 